Live from Acadiana, your local news leader, this is KLFY News 10 Morning Rush. The time is now 6.57. Let's get you caught up on today's top stories as you head out the door with the News 10 Morning Rush. Renee Allen, a shooting inside the St. Mary Parish Courthouse ended with an inmate deceased. The courthouse was placed on an immediate lockdown. State police are investigating the shooting, which also involved the parish deputy. New Iberia Senior High School was placed on lockdown Monday because a gun was found on campus. No word yet on if anyone was taken into custody or over the incident. Good morning, Acadiana. I'm News 10's Jasmine Dean. Two coaches from Lafayette Christian Academy are receiving a mix of backlash and support after meeting with a STM student who had gone viral for using a racial slur. One of the coaches says this was a teachable moment on forgiveness. Good morning, Acadiana. I'm News 10's Rodrigo Taylor. A father shares how writing an anti-bullying song helped his daughter cope with being teased for her natural hair. The Louisiana Department of Health reports 19 people have become sick after eating raw oysters at Louisiana restaurants. The oysters came from the Galveston Bay in Texas, harvested between November 19th and December 7th. A massive winter storm will cause numerous widespread and impactful weather hazards across the country this week. People are being urged to prepare for conditions in their area. The second Coats for Arcadiana Distribution Day will be this Saturday at St. Edmunds Catholic Church in Lafayette. You can stop by between 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. to get a coat if you need one. Hello, Acadiana, and good morning. Earl's Cajun Market in Lafayette joining us this morning in the Acadiana Eats Kitchen. That seafood pasta looking so good. Stick around, Acadiana, all day long. We'll tell you more about Earl's throughout the course of the day. And we're looking at some comfortable conditions right now. It's also quiet, just a little patchy fog. Warm and humid today. Breezy for the afternoon. Winds really pick up. Scattered rain possible for the afternoon. Severe threat is tonight, tomorrow morning. Tune in to Power Spot 2 tomorrow morning at this time. I think there will be a flash flooding risk that's rather elevated that we'll have to fight through as well through the morning hours of tomorrow. All right, of course, we'll be watching that severe weather starting tonight into tomorrow. We had Acadiana Eats this morning. Oh, yeah, Earls, if you're looking for some good lunch today, um, make a stop by and support them. Absolutely, yes, they're open every day. We were talking, uh, I know Gerald, earlier this morning, we were talking yep. about turkey rolls, lots of things yep, there. Red beans and rice, all of that <laughs> good stuff. Just, just know it's good. Yes, thanks for joining us here on Pots Pot 2. We'll see you at noon. Have a great day. Bye.